Hello um, everyone, or anyone. Um, so I wanted to talk about this City in Color cover for a second. Um, so yeah, I'm starting to get used to the cover now. It's only the s second cover that I've ever done in my life. Like I did one like seven years ago. Um, but yeah, I'm starting to get used to the song now. The only issue that I'm having, I think, is like with the vocals. And it's just how I sing. Like I sing so weird. Like, sometimes I drag words out longer than they're supposed to be, or I shorten them up. And when I do that, it gets me off track, like, playing guitar. Um, especially, like, I think it happens more when I'm doing someone else's music. Um, so, yeah, that's the only issue that I'm having with the cover. Like, the guitar playing is, is cool. Like, I'm fine with that. Like, I'm comfortable with that. It's just the vocals, man. It's just, like, just how I sing. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I suggest whoever's watching this or if anybody's watching this, like if you know how to play guitar or if, even if you don't know how to play guitar, like totally learn and then try this cover out. Like it's really fun. It's actually a pretty easy cover to do. And um, yeah, try to sing to it and get one out, you know. It's really fun though. Uh, yeah, that's all I really had to say about that. Just trying to waste a little bit more time because the video, the cover that I did, the little piece of it is not long enough because I never do a full song because I'm an idiot. But yeah, um, some other things. Uh, last weekend on Saturday um, was my sixth DJ set um, after finishing uh, my remix album or somewhat finishing it. Um, and it was amazing. And I actually got some footage from that, like 30 or 40 minutes of my friend set um, and then my set. So I'm going to edit some of that and try to get that into the next video. I've just been so excited about doing this cover because uh, I always upload a video of the cover and then I delete it and I'm actually comfortable with this video I just put up so I'm gonna keep it on there this time uh, but yeah I got some video from my DJ set and um, it was really great because the guy that actually has helped me produce my album and helped me out with a lot of my samples and stuff like that um, he has a huge following of fans like humongous and um, when he first ever introduced my name um, a lot of his fans really enjoyed my remixes and so now every one of my sets because I do sets with him every time like I don't do anything like he's the first guy that ever announced my name and he's always you know has helped me out with my other shows and um, yeah I always do sets with him so now his fans or his following kind of expects me to be there and you know they look for new stuff it's really exciting because like after the sets over it's like I get asked questions like if I'm gonna do any more remixes or people are suggesting that I do remixes of stuff like it's really, really exciting on like on that point of view, like the shows like it's it's different than the environment that I am 
in like I'm kind of the per like I'm kind of a quiet person and kind of um, I mean not all the time but like I'm kind of just like a, a laid back person so I'm not really used to that kind of crowd and that part is really fun about doing that kind of um, dubstep house uh, trance music like just the crowd and the energy and the atmosphere of it but actually doing the remixes and doing the songs can get kind of difficult sometimes I mean for me because I come from an acoustic background like sappy acoustic love songs so I'm still trying to get used to a lot of the stuff with this other type of music and stuff but yeah the crowds and doing the shows are probably the funnest part of doing that kind of music and it's just really great to just kind of get out of your normal routine and not be yourself for a couple of hours and just let go and dance or do whatever um, but yeah, I got, like I said, I got some footage from that and I'm going to try to edit it. I've just been really excited about this cover. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much the other, the other news about my other music that I'm doing. Um, but another thing about my acoustic stuff, like I feel like I'm starting to open up more, uh, with, cause I've been having writer's block, but I feel like my mind's kind of opening up more and I'm starting to write more. And so I think the writer's blocks kind of... I think the writer's block is kind of going away and I'm really excited about that because I would actually really like to start working on a few songs and maybe get like maybe like a four song four track album together and maybe go out and start doing a couple of sets like a couple of acoustic sets like around where I live and stuff like that locally and um, yeah I'm really excited about that and I just I don't know I'm just an acoustic kind of guy or I'm trying to be anyways trying to get better um, or back into my old routines of when I was actually all right back in the old days. Um, but anyways, yeah, that's all I kind of wanted to talk about. I just want to kind of waste time. Um, so yeah, uh, the, today the weather is, I always talk about the weather for some reason, um, but the weather today, uh, the sun is out. It kind of goes and comes like the clouds. It looks like it's going to rain, but then it'll just go away and then it'll come back. And it's been like that for the last few days, just kind of back and forth. Um, but yeah, the sun's out right now, and it feels alright outside, it's not too hot, kind of feels like October, um, you know, like fall, which I'm a really big fan of. Um, I like that kind of dull kind of weather. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. So thanks for watching, whoever uh, watch, is watching this, and I hope you have an amazing day and an amazing night, and um, stay safe, everyone, and uh, take it easy.